Welcome to The Great Journey, the journey to meet the smartest entrepreneurs of our day and learn the world's best marketing tactics. I've been in marketing for 10 years and the best thing I've learned about is launch campaigns. Join us as we interview leading experts, talk about marketing that causes success, and launch some amazing projects that will have an impact on the world forever. My name is Ryan Kearns and this is The Launch Lab. Feels good to be back. Happy Monday. I got a lot to do, so I'm going to actually create a video, an upsell video. Whoa, look at that. Somebody drew a cool flower on the board. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna do an upsell video. That's going to help me with my newest funnel creation. Uh, and that's gonna help me start selling my own personal products, which is something that's very satisfying and it's gonna be really cool as long as I can get it to work, right? So uh, the goal is to sell my own stuff because I realized with the last funnel that I did, let me just explain this to you. With the last funnel I did, I realized I was getting plenty of customers, it was really cool, and I was breaking even, which if I owned the entire business and I was breaking even, I would keep going and going and going, knowing that the lifetime value of each customer can be maximized by selling them other products and, and memberships and services, right? Um, but since I didn't own the business in that case, I was only looking to profit off that one product. I own that one product, but not the business itself. So it just didn't work as well, uh, you know, as an investment for me to keep putting money into it. However, if I own the business, that is a perfect investment because like I said, I'll be able to maximize the lifetime value of each customer by providing them more services, more more products and more um, more ways to work with me and more ways that I can serve them and help them. That is way more attractive to me, way cooler. Because then if I lose money on that customer up front, at least I have the chance to earn it back. It changes the entire game of advertising if you're able to do that. So that's where I'm at. That's like my really big goal this week is to launch my own personal funnel with my products. So I can really help a lot of people and start scaling my own business, which in turn will allow me to help other people's businesses even more because I'll have more you know, time and financial freedom in, in different ways. And I'll be able to you know, pick and choose the clients that I really, really want to help. And that will bring the biggest return for me and for them because I'll, uh, I'll be completely focused and committed with them rather than trying to just you know, chase money in order to pay the bills it's much better if I'm able to pay the bills with my own stuff and then really be focused and committed with my clients and with my partners. Um, so that's really the goal. I'm being really clear, open, honest with you. Let me know if you have any questions about my, my strategy, what's going on here. Um, and I'll be happy to help. So just comment below this video and start the dialogue. All right, so now I'm gonna go make an upsell video let me tell you about this funnel that I'm launching. It's gonna be really cool. So the first thing is an audiobook, actually, about membership sites. So most of the money that I've made online through online marketing has been for membership sites that have recurring monthly revenue coming in every single month. And um, it's an interesting way to make money. It's different than most people selling courses and stuff like that. So. Um, this audiobook will show you exactly how to set up a monthly membership and how to get up and running and you know use your expertise or whatever you want to sell um, in a monthly recurring fashion so that you can, it really provides a lot of stability, allows you to possibly quit your day job, it allows you to kind of have that recurring monthly income that's really powerful for every business. Um, we've also helped other clients start recurring monthly memberships inside of their already existing business. One of them was a brick and mortar business that we did it in. Um, so really powerful stuff. And, and this audiobook just walks you through step by step all the important stuff that you need to know from niching debt to, to, you know, advertising to, to figuring out your, your customer campaigns and figuring out exactly how to position yourself and figuring out pricing, all types of stuff like that. So 
that's what I'm selling on the front end. It's an audiobook. It's only $6.95 I'm selling it for. Um, we could easily sell it for $20 or $30 or $40 even, but uh, I'm just gonna charge $6.95 up front for that. So if you wanna check that out, it's gonna be live. By the time you see this, it'll be live at uh, sixfiguremembership.com. That's six, the, the number six figure membership.com and it's how i'm going to show you to how to make six figures per year by creating one website all right very simple stuff very very cool actually stuff that can really change your life if you're not already making money online and you want to okay so that is what i'm launching today hopefully i just have to like tie together a bunch of loose ends get everything ready in my stripe account get everything ready in my funnel make sure everything makes sense and is good to go make sure i have little uh triggers in there psychological triggers that help people for the uh for the upsells and for all the other stuff so that uh we can get it going so the upsells are actually memberships right they're recurring monthly memberships that you pay a smaller amount, but it's spread out over a long amount of time. And I'm a, I can provide lots and lots of value for that small amount each month rather than having to charge like thousands of dollars, um, which is you know, what I'm worth. It's my time is, is definitely worth thousands of dollars at this point. I've been doing this for a while. I understand a lot of stuff that people can, you know, avoid mistakes and, and figure everything out without going through all the hassle. Um, and so it's really cool. So that's what I'm launching today. I'm really excited about it. Hopefully it works out. If not, it's okay. It's just another one, right? It's just another funnel and I'll move on to another funnel after this and another funnel after that. So there's really no worries about it. It's just, uh, I'm, I'm excited. I, I really want to provide as much value and give as much as I possibly can to each person. Again, I want to increase the overall financial and time freedom of the world the average overall financial freedom and time freedom of the world. That is my entire goal. That's what we're doing. So let's do it. Which is my first uh, advertisement for that product that I was telling you about. Uh, now it's just like a waiting game. Gotta wait till Facebook approves it and then we'll see, we'll see how it does. You know, it, there's lots of things that could happen. Like the, the ad could fail or that or the funnel could fail or the product might, might not be good enough there's a lot of things that could happen so i'll keep you updated i'm just going to grab some lunch right now i mean in a perfect world everything would go perfectly right the ad would get approved and then it would start bringing in more than enough sales to pay for itself right away more often than not that is not how it works usually with ads and with funnels what happens is I'll place an ad, it'll get approved, and then uh, sales will start coming in, but not enough to break even and not enough to profit. So then what I have to do is I go, have to go tweak the ads and I have to go tweak the landing pages and I have to go tweak the funnel to try and get more conversions and more clicks and more of everything and basically just bring all the numbers up until it starts to profit off of itself and then it's self-sustaining and profitable. And that's the whole goal. But again, right now I'm starting off on the best possible foot that I can just by owning the entire product in all of the traffic and all of the, the funnel itself. Um, because normally I work with clients where they own everything that happens after the fact, right? In this case, I own every single thing that happens. So let's say I get a few customers, but not enough to break even on my ad spend. If I want to, I can shut it off and then a month later I can I can come out with a new product and say, hey, I got this new product to all those people. And it's just a continual snowball effect where the more I do things, the more effective it will be because my list of customers will keep growing and growing and I own those customers. I own the, uh, the traffic, which is the entire goal. So, you know, it's really helpful and I'm really excited to be on this path now. Um, I don't think I would have even realized that this was a problem unless I launched that last funnel that I launched that was making a lot of profit. Um, but then I realized that I could make probably double the amount of profit if it was my business and I owned, you know, and I owned other assets that I could sell to them. 
uh, once I realized that, now I realize it's it pays to own the assets that you're selling more than it does to just own the funnel or the or the uh, Facebook ads that you're running. So, super powerful stuff. If you if you're a digital marketer or you do marketing for other people, consider coming out with your own line of products. Remember, you can have your own line of products and then sell them into your higher end services where you're doing it for them later on down the road. Having your own line of products allows you to break even on your ad spend. It allows you to grow your customer base and it allows you to grow your, your email list while marketing to people and while making money and then you can upsell them later down the road into your other programs. So you, it really helps in, in a lot of different ways when you're able to turn that on. So I'm finally just getting around to turning that on in my business now. And hopefully I have some results by the end of the week and I can tell you exactly how it goes. Let's do this. Hello, hello. I uh, got a few things that happened. First of all, uh, I have two funnels running right now. Neither one of them is converting so far. Now, not even a hundred people have landed on both pages and I'm spending a good amount of money, not a lot of money, but a good amount of money on ads. What needs to happen is I need to revamp my ads and I need to test my landing pages to make sure that they convert better. Um, which is good because, you know, one the other day I was laying in bed thinking and I was like, you know, I'm not really satisfied with the, the, with the sales page that I launched for Six Figure Membership. So then the next day I woke up bright and early and went back in and actually created an entire new funnel for the same product for Six Figure Membership. So, so that was exciting. I actually got it done in one single day. Um, and I put a lot of work into it so that I am satisfied with the way that it looks, the way that it sounds, the way that it feels. Um, and so that I can kind of do a little relaunch of the product six figure membership. The only thing is with the new sales page, um, I want to do a sales video as well. Um, and I haven't been able to get to the office. Uh, so I have to kind of wait until I can get to the office to make a good quality video where I have the whiteboard and I have all the things that I can create a, a good solid sales video that has value in it that has you know that's a, just a really high quality video but then I'm still just going to be making it better and better and better as time goes on so that it'll start converting soon enough all right so luckily I didn't put a whole bunch of money into ads and lose all of it or anything I'm putting a very small amount spread out over a long period of time so that I can slowly watch the results and try to dial them in and get them better and better and better. Still no sales this week um, and that's okay. I just got to keep trying and keep tweaking and changing things until everything works out better. Hey, from my family to yours, I hope everyone's feeling safe and healthy during these crazy times. Um, I know you know, it's affected us a little bit. Our, my daughter has off school for two weeks um, because of because of what's going on with the coronavirus. And I just I'm hoping that you're healthy and safe and happy. My family is completely healthy. We're doing great. So uh, that's good. And I just I'm hoping that everybody else is healthy as well. So my thoughts and prayers for my family, and yours. And thank you for watching. My name is Ryan Kearns and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.